Hi and welcome to your session. Let us discuss the following question. The question says a ray of light passing through the point 1, 2 reflects on the x axis at point A and the reflected ray passes through the point 5, 3. Find the coordinates of A. We know that if this line is a mirror line then this line is normal to this line and angle of Incidence is equal to angle of reflection. Now in this question, a ray of light is passing through the point 1, 2. So this means this incident ray is passing through the point 1, 2. Let this point be P. And this ray reflects on X axis at point A and the reflected ray that is this ray passes through the point 5, 3. Let this point be Q which is having coordinate 5, 3. We have to find the coordinates of A. Since A lies on the X axis therefore its coordinates are of the form K0. Let's name this line as AN. Now from this figure we know that AN is normal to OX and angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection. That is angle PAN is equal to angle QAN. Now as angle PAN is equal to angle QAN, therefore it implies angle PAO is equal to angle QAX. Now let both these angles to be equal to theta. Now as angle PAO is equal to theta, therefore Angle PAX is equal to 180 degree minus theta, right? We know that slope of a line is given by M is equal to tan alpha where alpha is the angle made by the line with the positive direction of X axis. Now line AQ makes angle theta with x axis. So slope of line AQ is equal to tan theta. Now A has coordinates K0 and Q has coordinates 5, 3. Therefore slope of line AQ is also equal to 3 minus 0 upon 5 minus k. So 3 minus 0 upon 5 minus k is equal to tan theta. Let's name this equation as equation number 1. Now we will find slope of line AP. Now AP makes angle 180 degree minus theta with positive direction of x axis. Therefore slope of line AP is equal to tan 180 degree minus theta. Now A has coordinates A0 and P has coordinates 1, 2. So slope of line AP is also equal to 2 minus 0 upon 1 minus k. So we have 2 minus 0 upon 1 minus k is equal to minus 
tan theta. Let's name this equation as equation number 2. Now, from 1 and 2, we have 3 upon 5 minus k is equal to minus 2 upon 1 minus k. Now, this implies 3 minus 3k is equal to minus 10 plus 2k. This implies minus 5k is equal to minus 13. And this implies k is equal to 13 by 5. Hence the required coordinates of point A are 13 by 5 and 0. This is our required answer. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.